Hey there, Clandians, it's me, Cleveland J. Welcome back to the one and only Clandia. Yeah, and um, as you can see, um, we're in creative. <laughs> this is actually a copy of the world. You can tell because we're on day zero. <laughs> but, I just want to show you a few things first. You know, ignore that, that was for when I um, put this into the world. <laughs> As you can see, there's some sort of glitch, I guess. I don't know what happens. I think it's a block too close. I don't know, it's not important if it's too close or not. <laughs> but as you can see, there's the base. And here's the area we will be working at. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> yeah. We're that close. This is only a 16 chunk around a distance. This over here is going to- well this area is going to be a city. As you can see, obviously. Where else would it be? <laughs> but like over here would be like the farming area. We just like head to like further this way a little bit. Cause we got this- we got this submerged ravine. Right here. I'm gonna be um, using this pond and this ravine and then cutting all the grass out to make this an island. Because, why not? But coming over here, the road is going to be getting changed. I'm going to be turning it, I'll, may, I may be turning it this way. What I'm going to show you is over here, what I, we're going to be doing, relatively soon actually. So, um, <laughs> yeah, I'll show you this first, like getting stuff planned out for where they're going to be going. Like right here in my theater. You know, I'm gonna turn I'm gonna turn the lights on. Let's turn the lights on. Okay. Ta da <laughs> Yes. We'll be enough about that. I'm gonna be doing a lot of planning. That building and this building are going to be getting extended. In that map. <laughs> but this road. Look at the sheer amount of deep slate I'm going to have to use for this road. And look at the sheer amount of dark prism I'm going to have to use for this stupid wall. It doesn't even go all the way to the ground either. That's me is metric tons of brick. That's metric tons of sandstone. Metric tons of emerald. I mean, look at this thing's roof. Look at this thing's roof. You know how much emerald this is going to use? That thing's gonna use so much quartz. <laughs> I used to think this is big, but it's not. Yeah, the road extends over there. Well, the road is, well, the distance let you see what's over there. I'll give you sneak peek. I'm not gonna show you everything that's over here. I'll show you like a little bit. As you can see, just over there, just like some Lego buildings. <laughs> I stole from Lego sets. <laughs> That's what this is about. <laughs> this is about what we're going to be building. This is going to be called J City. Now, this is obviously going to be a mega project. And if we just come back here. So, you see how oddly long these are? Well, for a majority of these buildings, we're going to put some automatic farms in them. You know, like sugar candy cactus and melons and pumpkins, for example. <laughs> Maybe even a mob grinder. And... This is the, um, the nice Slanders building from Rocket Ralph. <laughs> and I decided like, to add a little something up here. Just like some glass. Because why not? Just personalize it a little bit. This is a road, this is where the road was originally going to run. I made it weirdly huge. Yeah, this road will just like extend down through here. Go um off this way and stuff, and like into like the countryside and the rural place. You know, like places like the Pizza Hut and QT that I built. Well, the tutorials for it, I should say. 
and various other things. This building right here is um, spread off, I think, the Empire State Building, where like the top, like the windows would open up, and like the blimps or whatever could like come over here, and you could go inside. Idea for like this, because back in the day in Calandia, this was the tallest building. That's not the case anymore because the um, the model of of the building. <laughs> but this is like this is just um, a general idea of what's going to be coming. And then here we have like a little bit of a subway. It was really booty in here. <laughs> but um, yeah. Let's just. Go back to my save spot. Let's just go back to the um Sabara World. And we are back. Oh that oh I forgot to plant the thing. <laughs> ah look at the beautiful sun, those sun rays. So beautiful. Uh <laughs> Uh, yeah, um, yeah, there's time. Uh, we're adding a new shout out. I am at. We're giving a shout out to Copeland or Copeland or whatever. Now, Copeland is my 100th subscriber. That is right. Copeland is my 100th, is my 100th subscriber. It helps like I can speak my own language. Because <laughs> remember, I don't speak English, I speak English. English is my second language, English is my first. English is, um, English, but you screw everything up. <laughs> but yeah, thank you, Coughlin, for being a 100th subscriber. <laughs> you know, it is nice. It is really nice. We we've hit a milestone. 2023, way to start off the year. And for the sake of nostalgia, for, well, not nostalgia, <laughs> just for the sake of it, we're sleeping in a little hut. There we go. Yeah, I, I had to put that in the, in the chat. <laughs> you know, so I could, um, do the sign. But let's go see what that place is... Yeah, let's see what that place is looking like. As you can see, there is no road over here. Now there's a pillar of dirt and stuff. So that's because I'm getting everything marked out. As you can see. Okay, we're already over here. There's some there's some obsidian right there. Okay. There's that. There is this. This is kinda like marking out the road. Let's see where we at. Okay, yes. So all we have to do is follow this. Stay on the level 71. And begin the mine. Yeah, just like this. There's not too much, so we don't really have to like worry about time lapse or anything like that. That won't happen until we start the buildings. Got it, 73. 72, 71. Okay. Let's see where we are in comparison to this thing. Not too far away, actually. Yeah, not too far away. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Let's 
I'm not getting back down to 71. 71 is the, um, are the blocks where the, uh, the sidewalk is on. Whoa. Okay, suddenly getting steep. And then it was not. I mean, that is beautiful. That is beautiful right there. You know, you know, when I begin to travel the world, I'm gonna get dirt samples. Just so I can, so that way when I have like guests or friend or family over, I'll say, I can tell them, hey, would you like to see my dirty collection? And just see what their, just see what the reaction to that is. <laughs> Which really is a collection of dirt from various other countries and states. You know, just the walls. And all this dirt will actually come in handy too. <laughs> you know, like terraforming and stuff, that may happen. I say may, because I don't actually know. Well, it'd be good, it'd be good for when, like, when we do the, um, the deep slate part of the road, because it allows us to put something there for the deep slate to be put on. I just realized that sentence made no sense whatsoever. But we don't talk about that. Like we've already talked about earlier, I speak English, not English. There's totally a difference between the two. But Australia and Minecraft's Nether are technically the same thing. Because both places weren't you dead. You know, the creatures, the environment, they're both hot. It's why is... Huh? There's just like a random torch right here. <laughs> okay. I guess. When we started digging out that thing right there, then yes, that will be time lapse. Because <laughs> that thing is behemoth. Behemoth of the build. Yeah, I'm only getting like the stuff I can mine out the shovel first. Just see what it looks like when it's like all layered down. Where dirt and stuff used to be, where it no longer is. Yeah, I should start, you know, I should start the mega base too. But what's, what do I want to do first, the farms or the base? Um, it's not gonna hurt to have a little bit of a chest monster. I'm not going to hurt anything. Yeah, having a little bit of a chest monster has never hurt anyone. Yeah, I've never actually built a city with survival before. So this will be a first. Because I was going to record this video earlier this morning where I actually build the road and stuff. Yeah, I'll just do that next video. You know, when I actually have more resources and stuff. Because I brought the bricks down. I brought the deep slate down. I just don't have the carpet or the granite yet. I mean, let me rephrase that. I don't have the carpet yet. I don't have the green light yet. But yeah, I was like, I plan on like, building various towns throughout the world as well. And, like, I'm going to be doing like some sort of like Sandy City or whatever you want to call it. I'll just call it Sandy City because it's a desert. There's sand. Wow, a desert has sand? I didn't know that. What desert has actually has sand? Gee. You learn something new every day. I know. I know. No, that did not make any sense. But it's like a Sandy City. We're just, we're just call it a Sandy City for now. I don't plan on calling it Sandy City. I don't really plan on doing that. I don't give me a proper name. You know, like JC, for example. That's a proper name. It's named after yours truly. So this is a second hurt crash, right? 
you know, like all sorts of the resources and stuff. They like begin digging up the entire area for a city or whatever you want to call it. Like, it's called city. <laughs> it is literally a city we will be building. There's, we're going to have that subway, we're going to have taxis, we're going to have buses, we're going to have trolleys. We're going to have everything. We're even going to have a blimp port. We're even going to have a shipping yard. People City. A place just for tutorials that I can follow. The full tutorials bullet. Because why not? I've lost count many times. I built Dantian's lab. I've lost count how many times I built Sandy's house. I'm in progress. So I'm, I'm on the fourth time building the whole world of Sandy's. Been taking a little bit of a break from it. Yeah, it feels like a little progress video. I'll just go ahead and leave a comment. I'll make one. I just need one person to say it, and I'll do it. And who knows, maybe I'll convince Stampy to um, add more stuff to the inside of his house. You know, the hub area? Just make it more him. Because I've taken the house, I just made it myself. I made the house fit me. Now I've put my own furnishings and stuff in there. Personalized it. Because well, yes, I'm building the world. I'm the one who's placing the blocks in there. In the recreation, that is. You know, the rep play. <laughs> Just walk from Darwin 68 and Stampy. Those are my two sources for the world. I started watching Stampy years ago now. You know, it was like the first video where Harry the Horse showed up. I don't remember what year of video it was, though. Because I thought I started watching it when the, um... When Seeking Feeling came out. Shortly after it did, anyways. But then I remembered. I was remembering it wrong. There we go! Nice! You got all the grass and stuff dug out. Get rid of these. Oh, I mean, the road just like goes up through there and over the hills and through the woods. Um, where are you? There you are. Right? No. Yes. You can barely see those trees. <laughs> that is so cool. In a few years, you will pull it. In a few years, I'll probably do a face reveal. That's in a few years. It'll probably like 2026 or something like that. Long way from now. <laughs> yeah. Long way. <laughs> I'll try this one out. Anyways, yeah, as I was, as I was saying, whoa, I almost took a picture of it. <laughs> um, yeah. Let's put these back on, and... Are you kidding me? There. Because my mom used to be the best boulder, then my sister, and now I am. I don't mean to brag, but I am. <laughs> my sister, I think she doesn't play the game anymore. Because as far as I don't have everyone in the house, I'm the one who's like, been playing it like, consistently, since starting. 
back in 2015. <laughs> it's almost 10 years now, too. It's 8 years. That's incredible. It is truly incredible. Eight years of playing. Eight years of playing Minecraft. And I've known about the game since long before. I just haven't really cared much about it. <laughs> well, because I've known about it since 2013, but I don't really care too much. And then two years later, I start playing. And um, I would have started making vi YouTube videos in 2014. I was too young. <laughs> you know, I was a little too young for that. Because you need to be 13 years older to have an account on YouTube. Otherwise, you're breaking the law. I didn't want to break the law. So what I did is I used my DS to make quote unquote YouTube videos. Where I just like record myself doing stuff and I'm playing the games. I pretend that I'm talking to an audience. <laughs> I still have the videos too. And I just like the Whispering Gust videos. You know, I titled that series Furry Things. Mon a few months later, I learned what a furry was. <laughs> I kind of regretted my name on the, the my decision on the name, but I'm not changing it. <laughs> It's literally, literally just about two cats. You know, real cats, not people. Cats. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I was like, we're friends. Um, <laughs> I told them, I told one of them the name and they, um, took it the wrong way. <laughs> but oh well. Oh well. Details. Right? Who needs them? Just grab those details, flush them down the drain. Details are for, um, other people. But yeah, I made, like I said earlier though, I made it to 105 levels. Last time I saw a hundred, over a hundred levels, was way back when, you know, the days of console edition was still updating, on a world called Hailstone is Cool. But then on that world, like, it was not legitimate survival, either. I didn't start doing like legitimate survival until a year or two after that. Like this world, for example. Legitimate survival. <laughs> I wish I had world edit to dig all this out. I can't. Cause that wouldn't be fun, that just... The moment you begin to cheat, in a survival world, all the fun goes away. I don't get why people just slam the door all the time. My brother and sister, they have a tendency to slam the bathroom door all the time. It's annoying because you can hear it in the videos. If like, if it's like some, of, some of the videos you can just hear the door. Oh, that's right, grounded. Oh, yeah, grounded, right, grounded. I was gonna. Okay, okay. That's what I'm gonna record after I'm done recording this video. Last time I had a grounded video <laughs> was December. Or earlier. I think it was November, the last time I uploaded a grounded video. <laughs> the Grim Creepers Keep was going to be the name of my fortress. It's about time we start making progress on that. Stop being a coward. We venture off into the wilderness. If only I had haste. Then would things go so much faster. If only I had- ooh, copper. If only I had netherite. You know what? That's what we're doing in the next video. <laughs> I keep changing- it helps like I can make up my mind. But I don't know how to do that, so we're getting netherite in the next video. Full suit. We're gonna be fully decked out in the netherite. I have the sand. I have some gunpowder. I had villagers, so I can just like do the beds. <laughs> um, 
We start building the first building. Who would have thought? <laughs> the building the building. You know, building something is you're actually constructing. You know, constructing the first building. A building and building are the same word with two different meanings. It's just like close and close. The same word, two different meanings. Read and read, same word, two different meanings. Lead and lead, same word, two different meanings. It's weird. Yeah, that is why English is not an easy language to learn. That is why so many people like myself, who have spoken language your entire life, don't know how to speak English. <laughs> Humanity is evolving. Just backwards. Yay! I don't have anything to dig out! Awesome! That is amazing! That is the Alicia day again. It looks so. <laughs> it looks like someone just took a roll at it and just like. went. Snip, snip! Just the terrain. Yeah, and like over here is like where it will extend all the way this way. Yeah, and see how different it looks without that road? There's a lush cave. Whoa! Whoa, look at the water! Look at the water! That is so cool! That is so cool! Oh my god. Yeah, there's the coordinates for all of you. Look at that! That is a screenshot for this video. I have never seen anything like this before. That is an even better image. Okay, that was an sorry, that was an interesting find. Day 687. We are going to hit a thousand days relatively soon. I don't really, I don't really care about the days either. You know, oh, I've got this 500 day world. We're so cool. It does not matter how many days you have in your world. What matters is the amount of work and effort you put into your world. Well, the amount of work you put into your world to make it your world. That is what truly matters. My dirty boxes. <laughs> Anyways, yes. Perkins. And we head upstairs. We have Jeremiah and Defiant and Jockey. But anyways, thank you so, 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 so much for watching. I will see all of you in the next wonderful video. Bye-bye.